What's going on YouTube? It's your host once again, Crazy Squid, and today we are back with an amiibo training video. And today, we are welcoming a new player to the channel. So, this is an amiibo that I've been debating for quite a while. The biggest thing debating for me was what I wanted to name it. So, I didn't know if I wanted to go with something based off of like Norse mythology again, if I wanted to do something like that for the, whole, the three of them. So, obviously, you're going to find out in a couple seconds. I'm training a fox amiibo today. So I haven't trained, I haven't even practiced as fox at all. But, I've done a little bit as wolf, so it's, it's close. It's basically him, but a better recovery and... His side B spikes also, just not as hard. But, the big thing was I didn't know what I wanted to name him. So it took a little while for me to debate, like, what I actually wanted to do for it. It took way longer than I was expecting, honestly, because I was debating whether or not I wanted to name it after, like, one of the Norse mythology things, kind of like Fenrir is. I didn't know if I wanted to name it after, like, Something stupid like going back to my childhood, Sly Cooper, Carmelita Fox, or anything like that. But I ended up doing something, and this was just for my own entertainment. I'm naming her Senko after Senko the Helpful Fox Spirit. Thanks, anime. But that is. I cannot fucking wait for season two of that, first of all. Second of all, Ugh, she's so helpful and nice. This fox is not going to be helpful or nice. This fox is going to kick my ass. The real question, which skin do I want to go with? Uh, literally all of these are the same except for those two. It's been like a month or two since I finished watching it. I'm pretty sure Senko has a white kimono? So I'm gonna go with normal box, I guess? If worst comes to worst, I'll change the color, but I, I think I'm gonna go with... Actually... I'm gonna go with the pink one. Because the pink one is like the cherry blossoms from the final episode, if I remember correctly. So I'm going to go with that one for now. Great. God knows all of this is going to end up changing, but Senko is the one that I'm staying with. I've, I've spent the last couple days and I was thinking about it and I'm like, eh, eh, Senko. And because I don't have to worry about, like, giving it skills. We can just more or less get into it. Oh, this is going to be really fucking dumb. I'm probably going to end up killing myself at some point. <laughs> no. 
Uh, I just realized I only have like 9% damage, so this is gonna do dick. Wow, that actually did a lot more damage than I was expecting. Too close for that. <laughs> that might actually kill. Gonna kill. Hello, Ultra Instinct. I'm so alive, bitch. Come at me. Come at me. Oh, they're close enough to read that. I was slightly wrong. I win. I thought it was going to come a little higher, honestly. So I forgot to be able to do like that. And he's dead! And I'm on fire! Fox wins! Hmm. Mission complete. Fox definitely plays a little bit different than I was expecting. <laughs> Not in a bad way, just in a different sense. I don't know, it's kind of hard to explain. Shine stuck. <laughs> I don't think Fox has a spike now. I think about it. I think the worst part is it's like, even though I know I'm not wolf, I keep having to remind myself my side B doesn't fucking just Oh wow, he actually recovered like that. It doesn't go at an angle. I have to keep reminding myself of that. Come 
Dodge roll so it wouldn't get me who used it. <laughs> I shouldn't kill the other roll. Like that, you fool. I'm gonna freaking laugh at that asshole. He becomes aggressive as shit in the next freaking fight that I do with him. Or let me rephrase that, the next episode. Because normally it takes them about an episode or so to get fully aggressive as shit with me most of the time. Oh fuck, I forgot I didn't have to jump. <laughs> I forgot to use both of them, I should say. We have it again. I genuinely expected him to go for another freaking shoot me with the lasers thing again. I couldn't dodge roll off the platform. That might actually kill, depending on what percentage I'm at. Uh, that's probably a kill. Yep. This freaking box is not that heavy. Oh god. <laughs> Mori uh, Tower, why not? I like this platoon music. Also, just in case I don't fucking say anything about it at the end of the video, because I might forget. If you guys have any fox combo tips or anything like that, I'd love to drop these in the comments. Feel free to do that. Because I will take any info I can get. Because I am not a fox man. Oh, I thought I was going to die for a second. Oh yeah, back here for days. Gotta get that shining. Gotta go melee. Melee your bust. <laughs> Tried to cheese him into like quick grab from behind or some shit. I did not. He actually got. Oh no, he actually knows how to lock me into it. Oh, this could be bad. Please. Oh, that actually killed.
God damn it, I missed again. <laughs> I'm kind surprised he hasn't been using his side to get off. From what I've been seeing. She actually got me. What? Sorry, she actually got me. God, it's weird making characters that aren't enough. Please. Say shit about him not using his freaking side B, and then he uses the side B. He didn't attack that. That's weird. I mean, granted, he's only like level like team, but that's a little bit surprised we didn't try to get up from that at all. Son, you don't go down with that, first of all. <clears throat> I feel like the amiibos are getting really, really dumb, one. at least when I trained them at first. Because, like, Incineroar, Ouija, I think... who the hell else was it? Incineroar and Ouija, I remember killing themselves constantly because they couldn't recover right. But, like, after video one, they turned out fine. <laughs> The entire first video is just, oh boy, look at me, I'm on a fucking suicide because I don't know how to recover correctly. Oh boy, I'm just fucking <laughs> off in the distance. And I'm just like, you could have gone up. <laughs> up is an option you could have done. You know, that's, it's not like I banned going into the air. The wolf skin is the best skin. Fuck. I use side views at all. You shouldn't have shot me, you shouldn't have just walked the ground my ass. <laughs> or hit me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's 
That little spin kick and I'm fucking stuck on the ground. I'm gonna die. <gasps> yep, dead. <laughs> Strategy. Mind if I take it? <laughs> you bastard. Now where are you? Don't teach me things. <laughs> I will take full advantage of those dumb things. <laughs> okay, I heard that, but that does bullshit apparently. <laughs> You sit there and try to fucking smoke me out for the games of doom. You can't do that to your dad. I just forget. Stage fight! Where in the heck? Oh fuck, he turned it around. Well, that's definitely gonna kill me. Oh! I was expecting to go above, so I didn't even try to tech it. I probably could have teched that, though, which kind of sucks. That would have been a good learning opportunity. Yeah, I had no more jumps. That was my own stupidity. I think it was at zero. Or at least really close to zero. Even at 115, that's still kind of properly. <laughs> that's scary. She already beat me. God damn it. Oh well. Not 25 though, that's pretty nice. favorite legal stage. Where the hell is it? Because I never go onto it ever unless it's freaking competitive and it's one of the last stages left. I genuinely can't find it, which scares me. <laughs> yep, there it is. There's cancer. I just genuinely dislike the stage because of the curve fucking platform on the main actual stage. It is the most oh. annoying thing to try to deal with when doing normal attacks. Because if they're slightly ahead of you, Three, you might miss two, because of the one, angle. Go. Fire. I fucked up who I was for a second there. <laughs> Oh, 
this boss is not spike, or is it like specifically at like the end of it? Or is it specifically at the beginning of it? Well, I'm toast. Motherfucking back. Air. And get away from this freaking thing. Oh, fuck me then. Yep, that's dead. <laughs> Shouldn't try to freaking do that. Nice sitting with you for the last little bit. back here. Got him. You know, Seth was actually putting up a decent fight too, already. Decently high levels. <laughs> Level 31 at least, please. Yes! God, it's almost like I've been doing this for over a year. <laughs> almost like that. <laughs> uh, but that is about it. All things considered, I think Psycho's actually doing pretty good. The only thing that I am a little bit surprised about is that she killed herself as much as she did in the beginning. Uh, again, that could just be the whole learning process thing, because I've seen a few of my viewers be doing that in the past. I, I mean, some of them still fucking do that, which is annoying. Like, Guts, as an example, still doesn't know to charge the side B to get back to the stage for some reason. 
which annoys the crap out of me. But, uh, right now she's not doing bad. I can't wait to see what she does in the second video. And especially once she finally gets into the, uh, tournaments with everybody else. So, other than that, and that's about it for the video, guys. If you liked the video, leave a like. If you really like it and you want to see more content like this, feel free to subscribe to the channel. If you want to get notified whenever I post a video like this, or post anything at all, uh, Amiibo training video like this one, Amiibo retraining videos, which I'm almost done with, uh, any of the live streams that I do, which I don't do often, but I do do them several times. It all depends on what I feel like doing at that point. But, if you want to do any of that, hit the notification bell. You should get notified whenever I post anything, so as soon as I put up a video, or likely at least, you should get a little ding on whatever device you have showing that you do have a video to watch from my channel. Uh, like always, links in the description for Peach channel, Mike's channel, and the subscriber-made playlist with all of my videos in it. Uh, but yeah, other than that, if you guys have any suggestions for, again, combo things I can do with Senko, aka Fox, for, feel free to leave them in the, the comment section below. Uh, also, any suggestions for equipment would also be relatively helpful, because I'm probably not going to do anything with sh like shooting damage, because there's not a lot of shooting attacks in here. Uh, and then also, like, any, like, suggestions on even the typing. So, neutral, attack, grab, defense, probably not grab, because grab I've had a very bad history with. Uh, all of the grab moves that I did have turned into garbage and kept getting my asses kicked by everybody around them. So I stopped using grab for the longest time. Pretty soon, I think Ouija is going to be the only grab type of that I have, and it's literally just because I want to check to see if it actually helps. If not, he's probably going to be either a defense or a neutral type, uh, just because he needs survivability, for the love of God. Not our attack type, just in case I feel like boosting his attack stat a little bit extra. But other than that, thank you guys for watching the video like always, and I will see you all in the next video.